Hello! My name is Shiksha Meitani, aka Bali Girl. Welcome to my channel. Today I wanted to talk about my name. Yeah, I know. You're probably like, uh, okay, we heard you. Your name is Shiksha. Well, most people I meet can't say my name. It's just like, it's not even that hard, right? If you look at the way that it's spelled, it's pronounced exactly the way it's spelled. But for whatever reason, people have a really hard time saying my name. I have been called everything under the sun, okay? If you can come up with a nickname or a way of saying my name that I'm not about to list, you will, on you will honestly just, it'll be very surprising to me because I heard it all. I guess I should tell you what my name means first. It's Shiksha and it's an Indian name and it means knowledge or education. And whenever my friends ask me what my name means and I tell them, they're just like, what happened? Oh, so funny. <laughs> anyway, okay. So, obviously the first name is Shiksha. You pronounce it like Riksha. Shiksha. I don't know why I have to say that to people and all of a sudden, oh my god, it makes sense, but whatever. Are you ready for this? I don't know that you are. Okay, here we go. Shishka, Shikasha, Shika. There's actually somebody in my family named Shika and my uncle can never seem to get it right. He calls me Shika and her Shiksha and he's known us both all our lives. Shikamasha, Shikasha, Shakisha, Shikamasha. Yeah, I grew up in the South, so. Shiki. Snickers. Shiki hmm. Shaka. Shiska. Siksha. Siksa. Shik. Shit. Shitska. Shikma. Saksha. Shaksha. Shaniqua. Sha. Shasha. Shiki Shiki Bang Bang. Shiksha. She. Shishi. Sushi. Shushi. Shush. Right? Shani. Seesaw. She saw. She saw. Dora the Explorer. Because I have black hair and I speak Spanish fluently, so Dora the Explorer. <laughs> yeah. Just us. S. Yeah. Shakira. Okay. I have a few more, but these have stories, so. Are you ready for this? Um. Sista. So I used to volunteer at an assisted living home when I was in high school and it was an assisted living and Alzheimer's home and this older woman, she was like, what's your name? And I was like, Shiksha. So she said, Sista? And I said, no, it's Shiksha. And she's like, Sista? And that happened a few times. And then finally I was like, yes, yes, it's Sista. I felt so bad just because, honestly, she just wasn't going to remember my name in a few minutes anyway, so it was fine. But, so I've been called Sista. Okay, I've been called just X. This is a really sad story. Um, I'm a little bit scarred when I was, oh gosh, I think it was in the sixth grade. I went to a birthday party. And you know when you're at a birthday party and they write your names on those cups so you know which cup is yours? Well, the lady went around writing all of our names on the cups and when she came to me, she's like, okay, so what's your name? And I said, Shiksha. And, and she's like, what? I said, it's Shiksha. I'm sorry, can, can you spell that? I was like, yeah, sure, it's S-H-I, and she's just like, you know what, just X, just X. And she put an X on my cup. And ever since, my friends in lower, middle, high school, right um, from that time, they started calling me X. It's a true story. Like I said, I'm scarred. Didi, because Indians call their older sisters Didi, so my sister calls me Didi. My dad calls me Didi for whatever reason, and then I'm the oldest cousin, so 
Vivi gets attached to my name, and so I've just become everybody's Vivi. And then my sister got creative with Vivi and started calling me Vivi Meister and Deeds sometimes. So there you go, that's two more. Shitka. Oh yeah, you heard me. So the story behind that one is that my teacher was an older man that everybody respected and he would call out roll every day in class and he'd always say shitka. And of course, my classmates and friends would all just kind of like snicker underneath their breath, be like, ah, ha, 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 ha. But I, I wasn't gonna correct him, right? He was, he wasn't doing it on purpose. That's all I can come up with right now. But let me tell you, there's definitely more. I just have to remember them all. I've been called so many different things in my life. It's just unbelievable. If I meet somebody and they can say my name correctly on the first try, I am genuinely very impressed. And I don't even think I have that hard a name. But based on my experience, I'm impressed. Uh, that being said, I'm never really offended if somebody can't say my name. I am so unbelievably used to it. It does not bother me like at all. I just think it's really funny. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know if you have a really hard time introducing yourself to people. Do you have a really tough name too? That's just been something I've had to deal with pretty much all my life, actually. If you have a hard name and you have trouble introducing yourself, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. And if you can think of any other names that I did not mention, put it in the comments below. I'd be interested to see what you guys come up with. And uh, click on the links right there to see some of my previous videos and become a Bali star by subscribing. I'll see you guys soon. Thanks so much for watching. I'm going to be a Bollywood star. You can be one too.